I, I've been coming. I'm going to continue to come. Mitchell. I've been coming. He's going to continue to come. And people just need to get over that. Um, stupendous. You're a knob. Hey, look at us. Look at us. Huh? Who would have thought? Not me. Are you struggling to win on FIFA because your team is really bad? This team fucking sucks. Do you need coins for a cheeky new team? I need it. You can head over to u7buy.com for cheap, fast, and reliable coins. And if you use code McShell, you'll get a 5% discount. Alright boys and girls, now today we're going to be jumping into a very, very spicy little card, okay? This guy is, I think he's going to be a little bit slept on, okay? While everyone else is focused on the Harry Canes and the, you know, the Mertens, the Laporte, you know, those, these kinds of players. We've got a little Lazari here, which I think is going to go under some of your guys' radars. Not to mention he offers a very sexy little perfect link to our boy Chiro Immobile, so plenty of links out there. So, uh, we've actually put him, I, I think he's good enough for this, we've actually put him in our main team. Team, okay, we've built a team around him to use properly. So yeah, guys, as you can see, I've got a little bit of a team here going on, you know, a lot of special cards in here this early on, which I'm very happy with. Uh, I did sell that Lampard, lads. I don't know if you guys watched the last episode, but I did say and, and show you guys that I did pick up uh, Lampard. Wasn't bad, not bad icon, but for 300k, I just think there's better options out there. Not to mention, I was looking for someone a little bit more defensive, uh, because Milinkovic Savic, uh, as much as I love him, the high medium work rates, likes getting forward a lot and having Lampard and Milinkovic Savage in in the two in the with the two centre mids you know in the 4-4-2 it was very attacking you know and instead lads instead we've gone with this Andre card who uh, has slightly better work rates okay so he's going to drop back a little bit more uh, but as you guys can see by the defending very nice very incredible defending there mm, so good and tasty so what we're actually going to do with this card lads as you can see by the pretty terrible shooting okay there's not much point him going forward he's not really offer too much in front of goal so I've actually but stay but while attacking on Andre and just allowing Milinkovic Savic to you know push up and, and score as many goals as he likes without me having to worry about getting hit on the break as much. And yeah, this Andre card looks phenomenal, lads. He's got a really nice card, however, is quite pricey at the minute. So I would say that you know, well, while uh, an amazing card, he's not the quickest. So 96k is a lot of money for this card. It's still good though. I think I still think it looks very good, and hopefully, hopefully he makes this team very sexy. Obviously, you've got Mikel in here who looks amazing, and obviously we did that in the last episode. And it was it was pure torture, but we now have him in the team. Uh, we've got Klosterman back here. We've got you know pretty standard defense, pretty much. But obviously we come up to the forwards here, and we've still got John Barnes, who's of course just amazing. I mean he, he's been incredible for us. We've got Rashford, who again the record it's not looking great for him. I wish he was a little bit better. Like I was saying in the last episode, I just I don't know. I think he looks good, and he should be playing pretty good, but. Uh, you know, I don't really use the skill move. So Rashford, for me, it's a, it's a little bit wasted on me. One of you guys would have much preferred this Rashford to me, but I'll, I'll, I'll still take it. Still a nice card and everything. But lads, we come over to Lazari, and I'm telling you, this card is fucking going to be slept on, okay? Because for starters, and it doesn't start good, free star, free star. So, so you guys are going to see that and be like, fuck that. No, don't want it. Don't want to hear it. But if you give this card a chance, okay, aside from the weak foot, the rest of the card is really good. The pace isn't the best. It's not bad. Bad, but it could be better, you know, it could be better. But what really stood out to me, lads, is the shooting. 99 attacking positioning and 90 finishing. Whoa! That is like team of the season level good, all right? That is pretty fucking crazy. I wish he had a little bit more shot power. That's really the only shooting stat here that I'm not too pleased with. I wish he had just a bit more shot power that's a little bit low. Uh, but the rest of the shooting stats are, you know, pretty solid there. But of course, you know, the positioning and the finishing are just out of this world. But also the dribbling here is really good. 88 agility, 92 balance, very nice. 85 in-game dribbling, pretty good composure, not too crazy but not bad, uh, and 84 ball control, and also has really good stamina, so again, with, with this card, if you ignore the, you know, the skill moves and weak foot, you've got a bit of a baller here, a bit of a slept on little gem, and not to mention, you can pick this card up for 30,000 coins, and by the time I get this video out, which will, but I, I'm really bad lads at the minute at getting videos out, I keep making them, and then it takes me a minute to edit them, and they, there's like a backlog of videos uh, that I keep, I'm, I'm fucking up a bit, so but when would this video go? Out. I should be able to get this video out to you guys by 
Wednesday? I think this video is coming out Wednesday, but but by the time this video comes out, he'll be cheaper than 30k. You'll be able to pick this card up for like 20,000 coins, which is, is criminal, okay? With those shooting stats, with that finishing, that is criminal. You cannot do that. So, Les, we won't waste too much time, okay? We'll jump straight into... We're we'll jumping to Fuck Champs again. We did in the last episode right at the end, so I'll do it again. We'll, we'll play some more Fuck Champs. Hopefully, Lazari is going to play well. I'm really banking on him. Uh, when we do play him normally, I will be using him as a right mid, uh, but for, for this episode, I'm actually going to be using Using, using him as a striker because you know with the 90 the 90 finishing and 99 positioning if I'm being honest I think this card would be best played as a striker but lads I love John Barnes too much to, to remove him from that striker position so when we actually use him we'll be using him as a right mid yeah hopefully we can get some wins boys and girls so let's jump into game number one corner all right not one into Millie Savage you know how this works by now boys it's a great ball. Oh my god, Lazari. Lazari, Lazari, Lazari. Out uh, of all the things that we were listing on your card, heading was not one of them. First of all, you need to quit lying. No. Oh! Fuck off! Fucking Ben Yedda, man. How is he still a thing? How is he still in this fucking game and be doing bits? Like, come on. Lazari, just, just hold on to the fucking thing. Lovely pass, Rashford! That is more like it, Rashford! I need more of that from you. That is quality. If you do more of that, if you do more of that, we're gonna be get we're gonna be getting on just fine. Fucking put a foot in, man! Put a foot in there! You're standing next to him on prison circle! Dummy! Idiot boy! Melee, melee, play it through. Good pass, solid pass. Lazari did a little aid, finish it. That is a little, that is quality from Lazari. It was, it was quality. It was really aid from him, but the finish was so good. Beautiful. Put fit in, please. Hey, Kelly, man, just come on, dude. Just like, come on, dude. Just do your leg out. Just do it. Just do it. So you don't see it. Just do it. I swear to God, dude, like, my defense is just not added to that. Stick, please. Lads, 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 question. QUESTION! What the fuck? Why did the full animation look like it went wide? But no, 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 just not ignore the fact that my player just randomly booted it over to Griezmann without reason. And now I'm losing a game that actually matters because it's for champions. He's gonna win, he's gonna win. Oh, he's gonna win it. Oh. Why? I just could have easily won this game. Like, so easily. Pathetic ass fucking performance. Well, overall, boys and girls, I don't think we can, like, question Lazari's performance there. He was actually really good. Scored himself two very nice goals. You know, he got himself a header, which was very surprising. And uh, scored himself another goal. Also got an assist, which I didn't know. So very nice. Very good performance from him. So far, boys and girls, I, I, it's not much bad to say about him. He feels really nice on the ball. Uh, you know, the shooting was really good. He didn't have too many shots, but, you know, he scored that, that, that one chance that he got. The only thing I will say about him, really, is the pace. He doesn't feel slow. But he definitely doesn't feel far. He feels what he is, you know. He feels like 85 pace. He doesn't feel blisteringly quick, which is kind of it's kind of annoying because he feels so smooth on the ball. Like with the mobile, it's understandable because he's quite clunky. So he obviously you don't feel the as much, you know. Immobile doesn't feel that quick, you know. Whereas Lazari feels so smooth when he's on the ball, and then when you try to sprint, he doesn't feel the quickest in fullbacks and stuff. Do tend to catch up a little bit too quickly for my liking. But other than that, I really don't have like any bad things to say about him. He, he felt really good and for like a 30,000 coin card, he feels really good, you know. So let's we're jumping to another game with Lazari. Hopefully we can actually get a win this time because, you know, fuck champions, I actually need to fucking start winning uh, these fuck champs games. So guys, we jump to game number two. Someone in the box though. What a po that's it. This is how is that card 500 like 600k? It's not worth it. It's just not worth it. 
Oh my god, Lazaro, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. Ref, no, just let me. I'm literally about to if he saves this. If he saves this, I'm gonna be. Don't even think, don't, don't even look at that ball. Fuck it. You don't even. You just let it go in. Oh, he's giving it away really badly. Easy sweat. No! Oh, nearly got it. He nearly got it. That was nearly a bad decision from me. It worked out, but fucking hell. Third ball to Lazari. Pen! 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 Let's go for it. He hesitated there. Lazari's dribbling, lads, is outrageously good. It is outrageously good. I don't know why I put it so close to the post. I'm so tired. Dingwit! I'm fucking stupid! Yep. Nice. Slip it in. Immobile! Come on! I think that's a hat trick for Chiro. I think. Great pass. Lazari. Chip the keeps. That could be delicious. That is delicious. A quality chip from you, Lazari. The positioning and the run very much come in handy there. He was in a really good position to receive that through ball from Chiro. Nice, and then play him. Lovely. Has Lazari got the pace? So far, so good. Has he got the finish? He absolutely fucking does. God damn, this Lazari is good. He's got some skills. No, that'll do it, EA. Come on, blow that whistle. Protect my clean sheet for me. Slide. Uh, I mean, it was, I thought it was a foul, but we got the job done there, boys. 5 0. Very nice. Very good. Four goal dance and a clean sheet dance up and coming. Overall, boys and girls, like seriously, like this card for the price you're paying. And again, by the time this video comes out to you guys, he's gonna be like 20k. If that's not a bargain, I don't know what is, lads. Do yourselves a favor. If you need a right mid from the Serie A, there really isn't much better. You can get the Lozano in form, but he's quite a lot of money, I believe. If the lack of skill moves does not bother you, lads, this card is top notch, okay? He is quality. He's got unbelievable dribbling. I'm telling you, this card, this card feels like he's on an ice ring all the time. His 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 footwork is so good, right? He feels incredible that agility his shooting is top notch his attacking positioning is like it can't get better uh, it's just amazing the only thing he's lacking really is the skill moves and the weak foot obviously i don't really care about the skill moves and weak foot this year doesn't matter as much you know you you can score some goals on weak foots this year unlike last year and the only real criticism i really do have is that he does not feel the fastest he's so good at dribbling i just wish he had a touch more pace to go with that amazing dribbling because it you know when he once he gets going he can be caught out by fullbacks and stuff like that if they you know if they if they're rocking out with really fast uh, fullbacks or center backs so he can be caught up but if you're playing this card as a cam he's gonna be a nightmare to deal with uh, with that dribbling his shooting is again just so good so I, I do think this this card is genuinely amazing it's gonna be interesting to see how this card plays as a winger for me because I'm used to Adama Traore and what Adama Traore definitely has is pace if nothing else so it's gonna be interesting to see what his pace is like out wide I hope that with that really good dribbling it's not gonna matter too much and obviously it will add an extra layer to what Adama couldn't bring to the table and that is that incredible shooting like that he's got. So hopefully things work out as a winger but definitely as a striker you know from what we use in this game lads if you if you want a striker and you want to like move him in that like he is quality up front. But anyway lads I think it's going to call it I hope you did enjoy. I'm not terribly sure what we're going to be doing for the next episode. I would love to do an Acampos review because he looks quite similar to Lazar uh, Lazari really. A lot more expensive but you know because he has like the skill moves and stuff like that but I would still be interested to use him. I'm not terribly sure what SVCs are going to be coming out and stuff, so if there's a really good SVC, I might want to do that. I would love to do a 9 Galan review, but right now I can't afford him, so maybe if he comes down in price, we might review him. So there's plenty, plenty of options out there for us. Anyway, let's hope you enjoyed. Uh, smash the like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys. See you guys in the next one, alright? Peace. <laughs>